We're just a little north of Marpoon, uh, a place called Cullen Point. Uh, this area here is actually the outlet of the Wenlock River. So we're going to have a look around. There's uh, turtle nesting around here. I don't know whether that's at the moment or not. I think it's July to September, so yeah, it would be around about now. But I don't think we'll see anything. But uh, we're just going to have a look on the beach. So at Cullen Point, welcome to Old Mapoon or Marpoon. Marpoon Backbeat, Marine Debris, 12,900 rubber thongs and 12,700 plastic bottles in 12 months. And most of it's washed ashore from the ocean, originating from foreign countries. This is the, uh, the campground at Cullen Point. It's actually closed at the moment uh, until Easter weekend next year. Uh, Cullen Point again. A little bit further around, just previously we were at uh, what they call the back beach. It's a little bit windy up here, a bit more exposed We're out in the open. There's a boat ramp here as well. Just on a track off the Weeper Marpoon Road, uh, heading down towards the Wenlock River. Uh, I think there's a camping ground down there, and uh, somewhere we're looking for somewhere to sit down and have some lunch. There's a place called Clow Landing. It's the uh, Wenlock River boat ramp. We're just going to stop and have some lunch. Try not to become crockbait. Bit windy. This is a track into Crystal Clear Creek, and we stop. There is warning of crocodiles here. The sun's breaking through. It is a crystal clear creek, like it says on the map. There's a green ant's nest. And they know I'm here too. This is the way out of the uh, Crystal Creek, I'm covered in green ants here, so I better get moving. Only a few hundred metres in on the road or the track to Vices Crossing, and uh, we spotted this on the side of the road, so we thought we'd come and have a look. Looking out for snakes as well, nice long grass. Looking at that, it's probably a um, something for mine, mining. Oh, yeah. It looks like some sort of bucket lift or uh, Something they would have used in mining to bring the uh, the diggings back up to the surface. Must have been steam driven or something. There's, there's a big belt pulley on the end of it to run it, so I'm guessing that's where it, um, they would have had a steam engine at, or, or some sort of engine at that end to power it. The fact with the traditional owners welcome you to. Negwa, 
Vice is crossing. Somebody set the significant trees alight. I don't know, it takes all types, doesn't it? Vice is crossing. Beautiful spot. Yeah, V Y C E S. Vice is crossing. Although it doesn't seem to be any obvious way across the creek. about as far as we come. Front goes a little bit further but only into the scrub there. Not really worth it. I'm up here on croc watch. <laughs> Michelle's having a swim. Everything looks like a crocodile, even the leaves. <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching. You're pretty safe. I can't see anything. For a... I mean it's crystal clear. So a bit of a backwash over there that's a bit suspect. Just a tad bit of uh, ball dust on this road. Have a look at this. We we're hoping to see one of the trucks come through. But uh, weren't so lucky. Not yet, anyway. And the smoke everywhere. They've been doing burn-offs right, right through this area, right up to uh, Cullen Point. And there's smoke everywhere. So it's not over. Oh, it might be a little bit overcast, but it's mostly smoker cast. Not really sure how to pronounce this correctly. Boucher, Bouchat. I'm not sure. B o u c h a t. At least it's not windy here. The tide's out a mile. And the water's, the, uh, the sand's very muddy. You wouldn't want to be walking out there, I don't think. There's some totem poles a little bit further around. We'll go down and have a look at them. And uh, I think Weeper's sort of straight over there. Other side of this uh, bay sort of thing. They're a little worse for wear, aren't they? Yeah. Especially this, this one on the ground. This one looks like it's been recently painted. A couple of them do, actually. It's newer. Yeah, I guess so. There's no sort of information about them. I'll have to look it up. Welcome to the Port of Weeper. 